Stuff. Can you describe the intensity uh, in training this week as you guys look to rebound from from three three defeats? Has it been more intense this week than than past weeks? No, uh, I think uh, we train in uh, like uh, always. Always we try to train uh, very hard, intense. Um, maybe we need to, uh, we need to win uh, on Sunday because we come from the three losses on the road, but the training always is hard and we are trying to learn every time, every day. And, and just uh, we, we train it about the next game with Colorado and that's it. What have you looked to improve this week uh, after those losses? I think you had to know why we lost. Maybe checking the game, or, or why, or looking for uh, something why we couldn't play like uh, the games before, then the last three games. But I think you have a, a lot of things for to improve, always, but more when you lose. And we try to, to learn this week and to try to, to play hard and try to win next uh, next game. It will be very important to win uh, on Sunday. Do you expect Fabio to be ready to play and would he take the left-hand spot? Yeah, I, I hope to to play. Uh, he can play. Uh, I hope uh, to hear uh, good news about Alvarez today. Okay, and Zlatan is out, so... No, Zlatan, I think, uh, right now he's just playing. Uh, the people talk about something the he kind of suspend them, but I don't know. Because okay, two of the players said that they, he's not playing on Sunday. They said that they're anticipating. Seba and, and Giancarlo both said they're anticipating that. that, that uh, about the will, Ibra? Yeah, that he, that he will not play Sunday. No, because uh, you know the uh, someone say something about the suspension, but like a coach me, uh, I am counting with him for the game. Okay. When do you expect that decision to be made? Have you heard anything from the MLS Disciplinary Committee? Oh, I think, uh, I don't know what can happen with him, but I am thinking about him on the field on Sunday. Does that, how frustrating does it make? I mean, it's Friday, you haven't heard what yeah. you know. That's yeah, I think the, uh, the Wednesday is the day that you got the, the play suspension. So, I don't know if they can suspend him, but I hope no. Uh, he will he will be ready for the game on Sunday. Are you surprised that it's taken this long to make a decision for the league to actually say something? Are you surprised? No, uh, I think I, I would be maybe a little surprised if uh, I can't take him on the Sunday because uh, you know the play where we are talking about. It's Nothing happened, just uh, say something to the, the goalie, the goalie says something to him, and that's it. No match. Guillermo, para, para aclarar un poco, entonces, no, usted no tiene la menor idea de que no. se esté revisando la jugada. No, o no sé. No, no eh, espero que no, espero que podamos contar con Ibra el domingo. Ahora, en el caso de que, de que no esté uno desde afuera, pensaría que, que probablemente tener a Fabio en ese puesto a. Uh, Apoyado en que no lo conocen del todo en la liga, ¿también podría ser benéfico para el equipo? Sí, puede ser beneficioso contar con Álvarez, más allá de, de Ibra o no, es beneficioso por su calidad futbolística y me imagino que hoy no lo conocen, pero si jugaras con quien jugáramos el domingo, en este caso Colorado, van a saber contra quién se van a enfrentar. Efraín uh, won the U-17 championship with Mexico yesterday. Do you expect to have him back uh, in time to be available for Sunday? And what was your thoughts about how he played? I think not on Sunday, uh, because no arrive, uh, he no arrived yet, and maybe we be tomorrow here. Um, I think he will be ready for the next game. Uh, we are very happy with him because he won the championship. He uh, he had a wonderful championship in Florida with the national team, and we are very excited to bring him again next week. Yes, yes, because it's the same time we are 
we were training here. So uh, he know the the tournament is in the middle of the the season. We we are uh, playing, so maybe uh, he will rest today, tomorrow, and Monday, Tuesday he will be ready for to start training. Jonas is okay. Yes, no problem. And what are you waiting on, on for Fabio? Just the Just the paper. Okay. Yeah, the, the, All of it. Yeah, the the club uh, tell me it's okay for visa, and this is. Okay. Talk, talk about uh, Giancarlo. He made his first start last Sunday. How he's looked in training. How he's. You know, he's a. Uh, he had a lot of years uh, like a professional. Uh, he's very professional and he trained really good. Uh, uh, support a lot of people, a lot of players. About the, this game, we lose uh, three games, but uh, he's wonderful like a uh, teammate. He's uh, amazing like a person, so he will have a, a lot, even in this case. We saw, oh, we saw a different formation against New York. Do you expect to start with that same formation again, or could we go back to the 4-3-3? Uh, I think we had the, the last game. We had, when we start, we had to change because we lost a, a, a lot of player, a starter player like uh, Jonas, um, Rolf. Um, we try with the other tactics uh, to, to play, but. I think that the best way we can do is uh, in the second half where we play 4-3-3. We, we were more uh, aggressive, uh, more dangerous for New York. And mm -hmm. I think the, that way the, the players get more comfortable. So maybe we can change something for the next game, but uh, we play with four in the back. Do you have sure. any concerns offensively right now for this team? No, no. we. Uh, I think we always got a possibility. Even with New York, when we are three-two, we give two, uh, three, um, two shot to the post. Another day again, Zlatan in the class war. Um, always we got a possibility because we we looking for the to be offense, and I think we got that. You just spoke about Johnny. He's good to go. Jonah? Yes, yes, he is right, yes. Guillermo, después de las tres derrotas, quizá de pronto pensando en hacerse un poquito más fuertes defensivamente, ¿existe la posibilidad de que Giancarlo vuelva a jugar afuera y no en su posición como central, sino por la banda? ¿O, o está descartado, digamos, que él juegue por fuera? No, no, él va a jugar seguramente por el medio, como central. Pero puede jugarlo, lo ha hecho y no tiene problema. Pero Rolf está bien y va a jugar Rolf. Thanks, everyone.